1951 is a heading contact departure. Their mission is to do whatever it takes to be ready for combat. Our job is to be prepared to, uh, for conflict and uh, to be such a uh, potent force that nobody would dare uh, oppose us. The 110th Fighter Squadron is the second oldest Air National Guard unit in the nation. Charles Lindbergh was one of its original members. There are 17 F-15A fighter jets based here. Their job in battle is to protect the bombers from enemy fighter planes. We don't have to be told to be ready. That is our tasking. That is our job. That's what we do out here on a daily basis. And when they do call, we'll be prepared. Most of the 30 pilots stationed here have regular day jobs. Captain Dave Svedine will soon start flying 737s for United Airlines. That is, unless he's sent to do much more dangerous work over Kosovo. Uh, a little bit scary, you know, to leave the family and, and go over and, and get involved in that. And um, that's part of the business, you know, that's what we're here to do and somebody's got to do it. And The flyers here at the 110th have total faith in the air superiority of their St. Louis built F-15s. They say they're still one of the most lethal planes in the air. As for their potential enemies, they don't have nearly as much respect for them. The fellows over there flying the uh, F-15C models, the air-to-air -air, air superiority fighters are doing a great job and uh, every time they seem to encounter Serbian MiGs, the Serbian MiGs get shot down. The members of this unit have no idea right now if they'll be sent into combat in Europe, but whatever it takes, they plan to be ready for anything. At Lambert Airport, Paul Brown, ABC 30 News.